How's it going guys, Neo Gino here, and I recently just got back from Retro Game Con up in Syracuse, New York, and uh, here's what I brought back. <laughs> Back from Retro Game Con up in Syracuse, New York, and uh, my buddy Patrick Milligan runs it. Uh, really good guy. It's the fifth year of this convention. Uh, this year I didn't get a vendor spot because I was late doing the uh, app in, but I still went up anyways to get some good deals on some stuff. And uh, yeah, it's a good con. You should definitely check it out next year if we didn't go this year. And uh, I'm sure it'll be happening again. I'm not sure if it'll be at the On Center again, but definitely a good time. And uh, so, here's what I brought back. Not too much stuff, but what I got is pretty good. Um, to start the day off, I picked up one of these bad boys. It's the Odyssey Super Mario Switch. I'm probably just going to keep it sealed. Uh, seems to be a limited edition run, and uh, so I'm happy to have one of them. Uh, when I got up to the convention, I... Uh, but actually, the first person that I bought anything off of was my boy, uh, it wasn't even my boy Grimsey, it was, uh, his buddy with that I was at his table, his name is, uh, Brian, and, uh, I got these two boxes for an, uh, SNES, Krusty Super Funhouse box, and this has a manual inside of it, and at the box, the Pluck, which is a pretty neat game, uh, I had the cart to Pluck, don't have the manual <laughs> and uh but i have to use for i think i paid 10 bucks for both boxes which is a steal in my opinion and uh he hooked me up on that without a doubt and uh also from the guy next to grimsy as well i tried getting this at avgc but we couldn't come up on a deal i got a manual for uh, super metroid so that now completes my super metroid box and uh off grimsy I got <coughs> this, <coughs> it's a Model 2 Sega CD, um, it's not, it's, everything's there except the system, I actually have an extra system to put in this, the box has some water damage to it, but for the price that I paid on this, it's worth it 100%, without a doubt, and until I find another box to upgrade mine, or upgrade this one, this will be in my collection for now, so, that, that'll be 100%, 100% complete when I put the system in there. Actually, it has all the attachments for the system as well in there, so. Also off Grimsy, I bought this. The manual for La Prior. The game that I'm missing. That now I'm not missing the game, because I have the game as well. So now I'm down to six license cards that I need. He gave me a, a stupid deal on that, or I wouldn't have bought it. Uh, I need the box to it now. But he gave me such a good deal that I could not say no to it. Uh, also, I got while I was up there was uh, this. Which <laughs> is pretty odd little trinket here, but what it actually is is an ocarina from The Legend of Zelda. It's, um, I, I want to say this is made of porcelain ceramic of some sort and it actually does work and uh, there's holes in the back of it all over it actually and um, it actually does make noise you could play sounds and all kinds of stuff with it um, so that's pretty neat and it came with a little uh, thing here to do different kind of music shows you how to use it whatnot and uh eh, why not something neat different and you probably don't see every day so <coughs> another thing that i got while i was up there uh, my boy frank uh i'm actually gonna tag grimsy's thing below here and i'm gonna tag frank from uh, forgotten freshness below here i got these off him he goes to put the great deal on them and that's Zaxxon's Mother Base 2000 for 32X. Complete, mint. And uh, Thunder Force 2. Complete in box and mint. So I want to thank Frank for the good deal on them. And uh, from one of the last two vendors that I got were uh, two 
uh, Sega CD games that I've been looking for. Well, the one I've been looking for. The other one, not so much, but I got a great deal on it, so I had to pick it up. And the one is uh, Cadillacs and Dinosaurs. And this is 100% in there. It's got literally everything. It even has the uh, brochure manual inside. 100% beautiful. And I actually got this for literally half its value, I believe. And uh, it's a rail shooter game. It's not like the arcade, which is what I really want, but I'll settle with that. And I got <clears throat> this off some two guys, Flink. Which, uh, this is 100% complete mint. Um, it's uh, it's uh, supposed to be a pretty decent platformer. I've never played it before. Uh, but yeah, I'm interested in checking this out. I know it's not common by any means. And also, off those same guys, I got some manuals. That I got Flink off of. Hudson Hawk. Circus Caper. Cobra Command. Cycross, Fantastic Adventures of Dizzy, and Shatterhand. And um, actually, the only other thing that I got when I was up there was uh, this. This is in a one dollar box. Box manual to Super Mario Brothers three for one buck. I'm definitely gonna buy that. I mean, it's not the nicest box by any means, but. I'll buy almost anything for a buck, depending on what it is. Well, pretty much, pretty much anything. Uh, but yeah, that's what I brought back from Retro Game Con. I had a blast up there. I always do. What did you guys bring back? Did you get anything good? Uh, let me know down below what you got. If you liked it, if you didn't like it. Anything you didn't like about the con, if you went. Um, and uh, this is Neo Gino saying keep smashing buttons, and I'll see you in a bit.